grid 7 and here's typical leftist media and how they manipulate people into thinking that it's not the far left that does anything it's the far right now self-described left anarchist who wanted to topple statues and attack white supremacists is labeled far right by liberal media uh, was on the 7th, so the story says, last week the FBI arrested two Minnesota men after a set-up operation where they pretended to be Hamas agents. Uh, the men were arrested for attempting to conspire with the Hamas terrorist group. I don't know many right-wing people who uh, identify with Hamas, really. Maybe if you go far, far right, but uh, most of those are, no, don't do that. That's mostly far left, really. They were quick to describe two men as far-right Boogaloo Boys. Uh, I'm not familiar with Boogaloo Boys, but uh, that's what they're calling them. As you see the little clip of the headline right there. Uh, CBS News goes on to describe the far-right operatives. The two men said they wanted to destroy U.S. monuments. They wanted to raid and attack white supremacists and said their views have lined up with Hamas. But I thought white supremacists, if you were far right, and the ones destroying the U.S. monuments are groups like Antifa, which is far left. You, you know, right here is, I think is the article, uh, to his self-described members of the far-right group, Boogaloo Boys have been charged with attempting to conspire and become assets for Hamas, the Justice Department said on Friday. Hamas is designated by the U.S. as a terror organization, and Boogaloo Boys is a loosely connected group of far-right individuals who espouse a violent anti-government ideology. I always like this type of stuff right here. F anti-government. Now, these are the same people who say that the far right is fascist, which is anything but anti-government. They're full of government. Now, so, so which one is it, the far right? Are, are they, they against the government? Are they, no. What are they for? Authorities said the witnesses said Solomon was openly carrying a firearm in a residential area of Minneapolis. And the witness interacted with Solomon and teeter over the next few days. Uh, they possessed firearms and substantial quantities of ammunition and that they and other members of the Boogaloo Boys discussed committing acts of violence against police officers and other targets. Again, that's not far right. Far right right now has been, or at least the right has been all about supporting the police. The far left has been all about committing acts of violence against police officers. And, you know, these guys themselves, they allegedly said their views lined up with Hamas and offered themselves some mercies to generate cash and other funding. Total sources and other things they believe to be members of Hamas. But you get right down here on Twitter. They say, I'm a left anarchist. Left anarchist. Now, as this guy said, no, what basis is a far right established? because it seems to me that toppling the U.S. government and the police sounds like Antifa. So much of the media is a joke. And he's right. The media is a joke. Because they want anyone... That they so much want to make the far left a victim of anything and everything and that they're the only ones with the moral superiority of everybody else and whatever they say is completely right. No. And... Anything, anyone that disagrees with them is far right. I mean, I, I've seen I've seen people that I know are left, and they've disagreed with some people on the far left. And the next thing you know, they're being called far right. It's a tactic that's been going on for about uh, it's been a couple of years now. No, just it's so so stupid. But uh, no, what do you think? Let me know, and I'll see you next video.